Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks, and this is the the same macro that I used earlier today called Adjust Object Retain Position by our friend Eskimo that does these for free, and I'll put a link at this at the bottom of the video. But we have a bunch of two-inch circles. Inside Corel, the only way to make them smaller would be to go 1.5, and then do that for every circle. You'd have to do it 16 times because you can't just group them together. But inside of Eskimo's macro, as long as we don't completely grab the outer one, we can change them to 1.5 by 1.5 and have them grow from the center so they'll be in the same exact position. But you could do this with anything. You can make them one inch, one inch, and now they've got one inch circles. I don't know really when you'd want to use these in doing this. This is, you know, right and center Y, uh, left X center Y. But so you always want to use this one if you want to retain the position. Pretty cool macro. I will have a link to it at the bottom of the video. If you ever, I mean, this is something if you were making a flange and you had it in the guy goes, you know what, instead of one inch, I need 1.25 inch holes. This year, this year, bam, now you got 1.25 inch holes. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.